Last update to 4102017 Seoul, October 24, Burnama decommissioning South Korea's oldest reactor that was shut down in June is expected to cost 719.4 billion won $637.3 million, and the process could take over 15 years, a parliamentary report showed Tuesday, South Korea's Yonhap News Agency reported. Cori One unit in the southern port city of Busan was permanently closed after 40 years of commercial operation, making it the nation's first reactor to undergo dismantlement. The state-run Korea Hydro Nuclear Power Corp. KHNP has to submit a decommissioning plan for the unit within five years, and the Ministry of Trade, Energy and Industry will issue a notification of the associated costs. In a report submitted to the parliament, the Energy Ministry said the KHNP set the appropriation reserve at over 700 billion won and set aside 583.6 billion won as of December. The latest estimate was upgraded from 643.7 billion won in 2014, and is expected to rise in the next five years to reflect inflation and interest rates. We aim to set aside the reserve fund by 2022, and the amount can change depending on the overall decommissioning process, the KHNP said. The government-run corporation had set aside 10.19 trillion won by the end of 2016 for decommissioning costs, with a goal of reserving 23.76 trillion won $21.05 billion for all rectors in the nation, Yan Hat reported. South Korea has 24 power reactors in operation to provide about on a third of the country's electricity. The 10 oldest reactors will be retired by 2030 as their operational life cycles expire one by one. President Moon Jae-in has used the permanent shutdown of Cori-1 to outline his intended nuclear energy phase-out policy, saying no new reactors would be planned and existing units will not operate beyond 40 years. As part of the nuclear phase-out plan, the government is pushing for an early closure of Wolsong No. 1, now the nation's oldest operating reactor, as soon as possible. After cessation of operation, nuclear facilities need to be decommissioned and all waste generated safely managed. The process involves the removal of fuel, dismantling of the plant and equipment, decontamination of numerous structures and components, and the demolition of buildings. According to the International Atomic Energy Agency IAEA, 34 nations have built 611 reactors and 449 were in operation as of April 2017. Among 160 reactors permanently shut down, the decommissioning process was completed for 19 and is currently underway for 141. Bernama